pull it together. Yeah, Noah's been out here in the TMTs. Yeah. Making it far, really like, well. every time I've watched, it feels like Noah's just there in that top five, top, yeah. top four, top three area. It's and uh, he has gotten a, a couple wins on SFAT, I believe, as well, and that'll, that'll be his next opponent. So mm. we'll see how that goes. Fox Ditto, Fox Ditto. Mm-hmm. Definitely two Foxes from there will play each other. Yep, so we got minimum two more Fox Ditto sets coming up. <laughs> you love to see it. Hey. These are, I mean, honestly, they are kind of like the embodiment of Melee in a way. Just the, the fast pace, the gimps, like the combos. It's It represents like what a lot of people like to see in Melee, right? It's shocking, just... shocking coming from a Fox main. <laughs> All right. Shocking. All right. <laughs> I do agree with you. Get this Falcon out of here. <laughs> I agree with you. I agree with you. I thought you were Samus man, dude. Doesn't Samus embody I'm a, everything in Melee? I'm a Fox, Falco, Samus, Mario come in. Mm. <laughs> Just threw Mario in there for no reason. I haven't played Mario in like two years. Oh, man. You're really reaching when you throw, bring out the Mario in the, in the crew. <coughs> oh, man. Yeah. First, we're going to get... It looks like... That's fat and null. Cause I, oh, it looks like Lucky actually just closed out soon. Say, oh wow, Lucky three one. Lucky's looking pretty poised. It looks it seems like he's uh, motivated this event for sure. Yeah, as he makes his way to losers semis, where he will play the winner of S Fat and Null. Mm -hmm. So we will see how this goes. Um, again, prior to this year, I don't know if Null had ever beaten S Fat honestly, but he has beaten at least once this year, maybe a couple times. I forget specifically, but I know for a fact that he's beaten them at least once, which is uh, probably a big step for him, right? Like, yeah, Because Null has been a player for so long who's been kind of on the verge of top level, and it feels like this year he's starting to actually get those wins that might push him to that top level. Yeah. So we will see. Yeah, it's going to be really fun to see the uh, 2022 rankings when they finally happen, right? Because mm -hmm. a lot of these players that weren't ranked in the previous ranking definitely would have been ranked in the last couple of years, right? Null yeah. being one of those players. So For sure. it's going to be cool to see where exactly they fall. It it will be nuts that uh, there's going to be a lot of players that debut really high, right? Yeah. Because of this two-year gap. gap without rankings. Like, there's going to be at least like probably five new players in top 50 minimum. Yeah, yeah maybe Plup will be there. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Yeah, maybe, I mean, maybe. you know, he's looking real solid. And, uh, he just kind of kind of shows what you can do when you're a new player dedicated to the game. Yeah, yeah. Just put in the time and you can really get some, some good results there. Good Lord. <laughs> Oh, God. Which Fox video are you most excited to see of the potential uh, mixes that you If can get Lucky here? S Fat happens, I would love to see that because I haven't seen them play in a really long time. Oh, dude, that was like the classic. Yeah, for a long time. Oh, oh S Fat! What a good start from S Fat. And even, you know, going for that shine shows that S Fat's poised right now. Man, the shield pressure from Null, but he doesn't really get anything out there. Cool. A little bit late on that grab. Drills have been used a lot, actually. Just the drifts. The various drifts that you can do with the drill makes it pretty versatile. To use the yeah. Day. That and the fact that uh, it messes with crowd cancel, which a lot of people mm. go for as well. That's a really good point. That's a really good point. And then getting the shine off of it, if you do connect the drill, is also really nice. You mm -hmm. get a huge starter on Fox. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Great smash the eye from s -Fat, but Null has brought this back in a big way. Uh-oh. Oh. Is that supposed to be shine up smash, maybe? Possibly, yeah. That makes more sense. Okay. Oh. Oh. All right. Like oh. that wait for the getup attack. Tries to get the read on the tech in place. Not there. Yeah. I oh, love wow. The, the back throw DI mix-ups too, right? Because you're going to mm -hmm. be anticipating them going to the platform. Right. And so you know they're going to be DIing left, and so you can use that to your advantage with the back throws. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a, an insanely good DI mix-up for Fox Dittos in general. Yeah. Okay. Oh, man. The slide-offs from SFAT have been on point all day. Yeah, I wonder if Null is going to be 
anticipating them and then trying to like dash dance around it and punish it, you know, uh, mm -hmm. after the slide off. Yeah, it's. I think that's like a a part of the meta that hasn't been developed as much as it will in the coming years is answers for slide offs. Because if you fully expect the slide off, then you usually can punish it in some way. But even then, it's not easy to do because they're fully actionable as soon as they slide off. So yeah. Okay. Damn, that's better. Popping off. Oh. Okay, yeah, he was definitely feeling himself a bit there. Hopefully he doesn't regret that. Oh. Because uh, Null's not out of it just yet. Uh-oh. Oh, wow. Invincibility. <laughs> <laughs> Wait for the invincibility. Yeah. yeah. Oh. <laughs> I haven't nice. seen that in a while. Fla <laughs> flashy death from Null. Um, and he is down 1-0, but he was also down 1-0 against Smash Daddy, and we saw how that turned out. That's true. So we'll see if he can make a similar comeback. Probably gonna be tougher against S Fat though. I will say that. Yeah, S Fat will play the lead really well. Absolutely. Completely just changing how he plays, mm -hmm. knowing that you're just very, very hungry for the opening. Right. Ooh. That was amazing DI on that double shine from Null to manage to get back on stage, because if he didn't DI that well, he would probably be dead right now. Yeah. Okay. Oh! Ooh. Wow. Really nice read from Null. I guess SFAT was probably going for a ledge cancel with the side B, doing it that high, mm -hmm. because it was kind of an, a weird height to go for it, but Null ready for it. Unfortunately, kind of missed you and dies afterward, though. Yeah. Oh, nice Jordan. Really good Jordan. Six shine out of shield from Null as well. Okay. Ooh. Wow. Ooh. Jab reset. Uh oh. Oh yeah, that that looks like it was gonna fall off the ledge just the mm -hmm. way that it, the momentum was playing out. Yeah, and well timed down smash from S Fat too, because if he had timed that a bit late, then Null would have went the other way and been back on stage. Okay. Ooh. That time S Fat's back was turned, so he had to do an attack after being pushed off like that. He wasn't mm -hmm. gonna just grab the ledge. So he's on the aerial. Null with another pseudo SD there. That's gonna hurt for his chances when he's down 1 0 already. Let's see if he can try to bring this back. Yeah. Oh, I love the way that S Fat is jumping in and out and then just picking out these shines. Yeah. That was crazy. The off stage version of what we saw earlier with the shine on the same frame. Mm -hmm. And there we see S Fat also getting the slide off again. ASD down tech on wow. the up smash. And goes for the up air. That was really smart. I think I really like that uh, a lot of foxes have been incorporating up air at the ledge recently because people are expecting back air and they're DIing. So they're not even remotely ready for the uh, smash DI on up air. Yeah. And so the up air is sometimes optimal in that situation, as we saw there. Great okay. stuff from S Fat going up 2 0. We'll see if Null has anything left in the tank here to try to bring this back, or if SFAT will be moving on to face Lucky. I think the big thing that Null has to do is just play around the superb defensive options that SFAT has been doing, specifically the slide offs and then that last position, the ASD and down tech mm -hmm. on the up smash. Just kind of you know, wait and punish those right. options. Easier said than done, <laughs> for sure, but, uh, done. but I agree. Okay. Ooh. Like the re-grab. Oh man, I thought he would go for another dash re-grab there. Okay. Oh wow. Oh. That might be it, yeah. That's such a good call out to put out that back air there knowing that Noel's gonna do like a really high side B. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's he's had a really good feel for Noel's recoveries the entire set so far. Okay. Oh man, just a raw up smash. Oh, and he caught him shield dropping with a grab. Wow. Get back up here. Wow. That's too good. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's go, Null. Not out of it yet. Oh. Okay. Oh, wow. I thought that might be a one hit up air, but S Fat almost never goes for those because they're not guaranteed. Yeah. <laughs> He's always going to try to go for the guaranteed option if it's available. Mm -hmm. It looked like he was trying to do like a like a DI mix up to get like an up smash afterwards. Getting on like the left or right side to do the DI mix up. Okay. That's Fat building more and more damage here. Oh, oh! That was beautiful from Null. One of the cleanest edge guards we've seen from him all day. And he's not out of it yet, like I said. Wait a minute. 
Back to shine. <laughs> okay. Okay, that tech saving null there. Ooh. Null really struggling in the corner against us, but yeah. Oh, trying to outrun the up B. Not quite, but he will close it out anyway. And Null on his tournament stock right now. Let's see what he can do. Okay. Ooh. Tech chase. Oh, man. I saw it back. Back in center. <laughs> Dash dancing in center. That's not where you want to expect to be. Okay. Corner pressure. Oh. And oh. Okay. Well, that helps not a lot. Mm -hmm. We'll see what he can do. That's why I tries to get a jump reel. Oh, man. That, that was the most chilling dude up tilt I've ever seen <laughs> in my life. Just the slight walk away into up tilt. I oh. love doing that. Oh, man. Oh, and okay. it leads to the stock. Nicely oh. done for Mesfet. Dang. And uh, the 3 0 on Null. Didn't expect it to be uh, that dominant in SFAT's favor, honestly. It looked like Null had gained some momentum from the Smash Daddy set. But that being said, it did not feel like Null's like best work overall today. Yeah. Definitely didn't feel like peak Geo. A couple, so. couple of SDs mm -hmm. over the course of that set.